Come on out, Murata boy. We'll give him a round of applause. Beautiful. We'll bring him out and set him up. The boy will then rotate that large disc in his chest to generate reaction force. Now this will correct the slant. Now Murata boy is going to perform this process over and over again so that he can maintain his balance and his riding position. Now this here is a remote control. We call it the magic stick. And it's equipped with advanced motion sensing technology. The magic stick is equipped with the Murata gyro and a three axis acceleration sensor. Now by waving the stick, we can communicate with Murata Boy via the Murata Bluetooth module. So Murata Boy, are you ready to go for a ride? We just got a yes for that, so let's go ahead and give this a try here. Now, by tilting the magic stick forward, it will make Murata Boy go forward. And there he goes. Then of course, that means if I tilt the stick back, it will make him do what? Go backwards, you're so smart. If we use our, our uh, magic stick, he will turn his face in the way that we point that magic stick. Now keeping in mind, he's not actually looking at the magic stick. Instead, the magic stick is sensing the motion and then sending the command to Murata Boy using that Murata Bluetooth module that we talked about. Well, thank you, Murata Boy. Let's give him a round of applause. We're going to see him a little bit later here. Murata Girl was officially introduced to the world on September 23rd, 2008. And now, well, we'd like to introduce her to all of you. Hello, Marana girl. Sometimes she gets bashful and blushes. She's so cute. She's a unicycle riding robot with an excellent sense of balance. She has three built-in gyro sensors. Now, Marana girl rotates this flywheel in her chest to correct the left to right slanting while rotating the unicycle wheel underneath her there backwards or forwards in small increments, and that will maintain her front to back balance. So what she'll do is accurately measure the distances and then move forward without lagging behind, and this is because of the Murata ultrasonic sensors that she's wearing. So she'll kind of move forward there as he moves forward, moves back if, if it comes back toward her, then she'll slide it back again. See if she'll back up for us. There she goes, she doesn't even turn around and look. She keeps doing that. I told her she drives like my mother. Now keep in mind, that's less than eight tenths of an inch. Very narrow. So we got her up there. Now she has a CCD camera that's underneath her skirt. So she can see the image of the balance beam and then send the image to the controller PC by using Murata's Wi-Fi module, her ceramic antenna, inductors, and EMI filters. 